Communities across our state paused today and remembered our nation's fallen heroes. Under blue skies, an outpouring of support in the Rose City during the annual Memorial Day Parade there. Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan continues our team coverage from Norwich. In Norwich, it's not a big parade. It's actually pretty short, about a half mile long. But it's very important for all those participating. Organized and led by local veterans, the Memorial Day Parade set off down broad towards Chelsea Parade. The NFA Wildcat Marching Band set in the pace as Scott Langan and his family pause and pay tribute to our fallen soldiers. The family understands. Yeah, a lot of sacrifice was given so that we can all come out here and respect these fellas. This parade is tradition too for Mayor Peter Nystrom, who marched this route as a young Boy Scout. I hope every community is taking time to stop what they're doing in their lives and reflect and honor those who aren't with us anymore. Veterans of many conflicts either rode in classic vehicles or paraded to the beat of the Kelly Steam Magnet Middle School Band. Marching right alongside and recording the band is Glenn Charles' mom, Otanka Charles. Oh, I'm so happy right now. I don't know. I feel like crying, having my son playing on the bed. Oh my God, it's awesome. My cousin was in the uh, service and uh, my uncle, and it means a whole lot to us about uh, basically the support of the troops. At Chelsea Parade, flags flew at half staff and participants, young and old, stood silently to honor the memory of our nation's veterans killed in action. I'd like to specifically ask all those here to remember the Norwich residents that stood in an unbroken line of patriots that have dared to die so that freedom might live and grow and increase its blessings. With the Mobile Newsroom in Norwich, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.